Sirens blared and lights flashed at Brownsville Area High School Wednesday, but it was all for a good cause. <laughs> Students Against Drunk Driving once again sponsored a mock crash to raise awareness of the dangers of drinking under the influence of alcohol. Members of SAD portrayed the victims of an accident caused by a drunk driver. Some students even depicted fatalities. Firemen and EMTs demonstrated their life-saving techniques and instruments, such as the jaws of life. A state trooper and one of the students acted out a sobriety test, showing the students what could happen if they drink and drive. One of the EMTs also spoke to the students. Because a lot of times with drinking and driving, it's not the drunk driver that gets hurt. Usually the drunk driver is nice and relaxed, so we don't see any trauma with them. They're usually walking around saying, I'm fine, I can drive this thing out of here. Meanwhile, we got a guy with his leg cut off in the other car. You know, and he's crippled for life from that. You really got to think about that. Out of those 4,500 people we see here at UPMC Presby, about 20% of those people are from the age range of 16 to 25. Your age range. That's a pretty high number. Almost every year we have a vehicle accident on prom night. Religiously. My guys even get ready for that night because every year we have a, we have a car wreck. For the Brownsville Telegraph, with camera work by Joe Cromer, I'm Larry Franks.